are in desperate need of victory after losing five of their last six home games. Croatia, Bernadeschi, Osorio and Kirk. I mean, Caelan, what stands out to you? Austin FC after a home loss to Vancouver Whitecaps make two changes. Wolf and Gallagher out, albeit... Away we go as we enter this stage of the season. Long staff able to clear into Lorenzo Insigne. And here's uh, DeAndre Kerr. Roberto Prince of Russo in centre forward today. One of several big calls of John Herman. And here we have the first yellow card of the day. Somewhat expected after the plan was laid out to him when he took the job. Bill Manning and the upper brass and MLSC saying this will be a difficult season. They get into the playoffs, it's wonderful. Here's Kerr. Able to find a way through the effort towards Kerr. with Osorio, finds it in behind to Kerr, but he continues his run. Watch him on the top of your screen here. And when the ball drops with that deflection, it comes right to him and it sits up perfectly. Just a fantastic strike, but the effort there, the will. Herdman's just been desperate for some leadership. Osorio missed the last match due to yellow card suspension. And what a difference he's made already here. Just strikes right through it. Insigne steps out the way. And Austin Kunja here. Pereira's ball in. The header goes up. It's not cleared away. Quite a scrambled and authoritative piece of goalkeeping from Sean Johnson. One time US international. Sure you're down under the challenge and the free kick for the home side. And the referee wants a yellow. There's another yellow card here. So imposing in their build. And now they have defence on their mindset as Bukhari brings it forward for Austin. Surely headed for goal. Pereira's ball in. Johnson got something on it. Not enough though. Not clear away yet. Scramble inside the six yard box is eventually steered to safety by Insigne. Bukhari brings it forward. Bukhari. Here come Austin again. A deflection of fortuitous for Sean Johnson and Toronto FC. Still a challenge made by Longstaff. And this is now Insigne. Between the lines, you'll find Osorio running forward now as Lorraine. Lorraine and Kerr! A goal made in Canada! Yeah, and it comes from deep positions. And look at Richie Lorraine just continuing his run. They find that easy ball in to Insigne. And then from there, it's just an easy ball right across. It's Almost just like a training exercise, going from one X to the next. Just right on top of the six for Kerr, coming in confident off a goal in his last match. Gets rewarded from the start at the number nine position and the homegrown. One of the easiest goals he'll score, a tap in to put Toronto up 2-0 here at home. Here comes Toronto FC, Insigne, Federico Bernadeschi, and Longstaff! O'Brien. Austin seek relevance. O'Brien's ball in. Not cleared away by Gomez. It's a wonderful ricochet into the path of Jesse Zardes. Here, yeah, clearly off there. Plenty of questions needing to be answered from an Austin FC point of view as Kerr now gets the ball from Heinzeich and gets closer and closer to the goal. It's Kerr! John Herdman exactly what he wanted, and on the other end now, Austin have an opening here! Fabulous save! At the expense of Matt Hedges, the former Toronto FC man, and here come Austin FC, weaving through the channels to the edge of the ball, goals, and Ring able to smash it towards goal and straight down the throat of Sean Johnson. Bernadeschi, the header away, as far as it's in, yeah! something. Suva equal to it. And down the line straight away. Long start with the timely intervention. Reyes 
job on any attacking corner is to try to be alert for anything that knocks down and get back into the game. Diego Rubio, the Chilean international coming on. You can see Owen Wolf as well, a consistent starter for Austin FC throughout the campaign. But Rubio, the real attacking threat here, Kalen. Yeah, it's like for like in the number nine position and footwork there from Stuver to stay on top of it. At the other end now, Briusi in behind. Briusi across goal. Is over. Has to go down as another major opening for Austin FC, and they fail to take it again. Could come in the way of Austin. Can they find a way back into the game, or will Toronto find another? Here come Austin. It's wonderfully done. Now then, now then, the referee has blown the whistle, pointing towards the centre spot. Austin FC back into the game. In the realm of relevance, courtesy of the substitute, Owen Wolf. Well, it comes from a wonderful ball over the top, but how about this for a first touch from Wolf? And the second one's even better to show the composure to cut across, to take a beat, the substitute with an absolutely perfect touch, to put it in front of himself and then to cut back across to sit defenders down. Petretta goes right by him and then Johnson is just at his mercy here. Just patient, lifts it over him to bring Austin FC right back in it. Lovely ball, thread through, real 